How's it going ladies and bruises, I'm Bobby Sixkill and welcome back to Nido Kuni 2 Revenant Kingdom. We're going to finish exploring this temple because it booted us before we were done. And then we are going to go continue the main story because it is going quite swimmingly at the moment. Despite the fact that we are quite seriously overpowered by our enemies, we are still coping pretty well. We just don't gain levels like, uh, like I guess we meant to. We're always level way, way behind as far as level goes. But we're still capable as far as like actual combat skills go. So, I guess we don't need to worry too much, but... It just sucks to always be... Everybody's fucking... Or has an orange name or a red name all the time. Because we're always fucking behind. Oh, I guess I like a challenge, so it keeps it challenging, that's for sure. Especially when we take on the, uh, the tainted ones that are well beyond our level. You got fucking smashed. You got gangbang, son. Here goes. Bye. Caps, bitch. How we do? Let's whip out my gun and pow, pow, pow. Pop a cap in his ass. Strong box boots. That's right, we picked up some gear too when we fought that boss. Probably check that out too. I didn't think of that. What did we get? I think we got some armor. Blaze proof warlord's armor. That's pretty cool. Anti freeze dead elf armor is pretty cool too. Anything new for you? You can have the anti freeze dead elf armor. And the blaze proof. The strong buck boots, box boots that we just picked up. Strong buck boots. The bucky buck buck. Okay. That's our team sorted anyway. That's enough for now. We can sort everyone else out later. Right, where are we going? Okay, so that goes right around. We still haven't explored this part properly yet. Plus this will help us get our level up. Oh, we're up to level 50 now, so we're actually only 10 levels behind their highest level, guys. I guess that's better than nothing. Oh, red. Gloomy Wizard's bouquet. Here goes. Fucking wrecked, son. You got fucked! Goodbye. That gun is cool as fuck. Suits you, uh... Bracken. Suits you with its... Techno laser beam thing. Makes me think of your technology place. Broadleaf, that's it. Hey, a pebble. Just what I wanted. How did you know? My god! Fuck you, Snaggletooth! One v one, me Snagglewolf. Here goes. Get fucked! Holy fuck! That was a massacre. That was a massacre. Wow. Not cool. Not cool. It was massacre time, motherfuckers. Alright, what do we got here? Okay, sorry about that cut there, but I actually pulled Leander out of the team. And put Tani in, because I was sick of bitching about Leander. Plus, Tani uses the spear, which we don't use in our main team, and also uses the bow, which we don't use in our main team. So that works out quite nicely. And, uh... Yeah, mainly because Leander's crap, and I'm hoping Tani's going to be better than Leander. Watch your backs. Which wouldn't take much, to be fair. That's a bit harsh. Here goes. That is a bit harsh, but at the same time, he's terrible. And you're dead. Bye.
Now we got a whole new way to explore, right? Uh, where are we going? Let me just look at my map here. Yeah. So we haven't been this way yet. We're gonna quickly check that out. And then go do some more main mission, I guess. Because we got a lot more to be done. Okay, this is it. This is what I missed. I came back for this. I guess I can do with the leveling ups. Wizardly crystal robes. I can do with the levels anyway, I guess. No reason to complain. I shouldn't be bitching. Though I do like to complain. It is my favourite. Yeah, I'm gonna keep complaining. Fuck it. Complaining's great. Fuck it all. Complain, complain, complain. I'm trying to keep their gear up, updated still, but yeah. Alright, let's go. To Evermore Castle. We must have some uh, kingdom management to do here again too, I would say. And research topics have been completed. I guess we're doing that too. We'll do that before we talk to Bracken. Nice and quick like. So there's a lot of fucking around in this game. That's just how this game is. See. From my in my opinion. 150 grand, Jesus. That built up real fast. How the fuck did it build up so fast? Alright, let's uh, finish our researches. And start some more researches. What can you guys do? Anything new? Efficient weapon development too? Get on that. We can't, because we don't have spiffy smithing. Well, I guess I'm leveling up the facility then. There goes 30 grand. Uh, before I do that, let's see if there's anything else I can do. Or need to do. We only need 8 million influence so we can expand our coffers again. Maybe we should focus on that. Because we're close to that 8 million uh, influence. Very close. Let's go level 3 armor development. Get some more research here. Rejuvenate. Nice. Yeah, we're over 8 million. That was easy. Alright, we'll do level 4 spell development. Now we should be able to enhance our coffers now. For 100 grand. But now we can hold 300,000. It's pretty good. Influence has to be 15 million for the next one. That's huge. So none of those upgrades are going to be happening anytime soon. And to expand the kingdom is going to take a long time as well. Third Higgledy cookbook. I guess we're going to have to go make some Higgledies then. If uh, we've got the third cookbook, we're going to have a bunch of new stuff we can make. Higgity rearing for professionals. We're not gonna, our money's not going to last long, but we're going to get some important stuff done. That's the main thing. And when we come back, we'll be able to hold 300,000. 300,000. Okay, that is, like, done. There's nothing left to research there. But those people are wasting their time still being there, realistically. I should move them somewhere else. And we got something done here. Store more stuff, that's good. And this one's full as well. I think that one's done as well, yeah. But there's nothing left to do here either. So they're just wasting their time, realistically. Hanging around in a place that they're not needed. And are doing nothing. I guess I'll worry about that later. For now, I guess we should start next lots of. Okay, we can't research here. Alright, let's uh, level this one up then. I know it's 30,000, but... Nothing else we desperately need to do right now. We do need to build new facilities, but frankly, I've got no one to staff them anyway. So who cares, really? Get that started, we got 25 grand left. It's not much, it won't last very long, but... What can we do with it? Can we get some research started somewhere? But you. Better construction efficiency, can we do that? No, we don't have builders life. Keep forgetting about that. Ship shape shipyard? That was where the shipyard was. I've been looking for that forever. We don't even use the boat anymore. Like the boat is it's it's in the past, man. It's in the past. We don't do that anymore. There you go, that uses pretty much all my money. So let's just build that. And then it's done. I assume I got nobody to staff this thing, though. 
Kingmaker's Cathedral. And the training ground. Now you need to be at the training ground? Okay, well. I mean, there's nobody, there's no work to be done at the training ground, but you know what? I'll store you here anyway. Kingmaker Cathedral, we don't have yet. I don't know where, where that comes from. Alright, let's go to the throne room, talk to Bracken, and yeah, we'll see where that leads us. I think we should be right. Hey, Bracken. Want me to get work on the Sword of Unity? Yes! Alrighty. You need to upgrade your weapon workshop first. It'll need to be at least level 4 before I'll be confident to pull this off. Hey, I just upgraded it to level 4 just then. Alrighty. It is at level 4. I'm sure it's at level 4. Let me just check. It's level 3. Well, shit. Okay, we're gonna have to burn some time. But you know what? I had a thought about that. Because I was having a look at, uh... The library section. And you can see all the tainted monsters. I say we go through and start killing them until we've got... We'll use the rest of this episode to kill them. So the first one's in Sundown Woods. I don't know where that is, but we can find it, I'm sure. Wiggly way. Okay, it's gonna be a lot harder to find than I thought. Just looking around for shit like that. So instead, I say we just fly around and pick up treasure chests, kill any tainted monsters we see, and so on and so forth. That sort of thing. Let's go explore some. What's this island over here? I've been looking at this on the map and I want to know what's over here. We're gonna land here, pick up some shit. Yeah, this, we're gonna spend the episode fucking around, collecting treasure and killing tainted monsters. If we can. Cryptic close range ring. Very nice. A slice of creamy cheese. Far away forest. I don't know what's over there. Have I been in here? I have not been in here. New place to explore. There we go. Found something to do. Come into far away forest and kill everything. That's how we roll. That's how we do stuff. We go into a place, we kill everything, and then we leave. You ready for this? I wondered if you were going to attack or not. Hey, level up. You guys are pathetic. Too weak. Too weak. It's because there was neutral ones in there. That were like, around our level? Not quite as high, like, close, but, yeah. yeah. These ones are all blue, so they won't attack at all. I guess I meant to have been here before, I suppose. But I've never had a reason to come here, I just saw it on the map. Hey, dude. What's crapping? Nothing up there. Uh, I guess we'll go this way? Sure, why not? So, sorry if this ends up being a boring episode because we're just sort of farting around doing stuff. But I want to explore, check out some new dungeons we haven't been to, kill some stuff. You know, that sort of thing. Hey, there's a... There's one of the uh, doors here. You know what, I think we might be able to cope with that one because it's in a reasonably low level area. Should we give it a go? I say we give it a go. It's been a while since we did one of these, like the first episode or something. Not enough power to unlock. Oh my god, is this like the last one? Wow. That's intimidating. Glad they couldn't open it then. Otherwise I'd have got myself sh smashed in. Is that it? There's nothing else here. Motherfucker. Alright. Guess we're moving on then. On to the next area. See what we can find. You guys are all blue? Good. 
I don't really want to kill you anyway. You're wasting my goddamn time. That's whole. This is so boring leaving. I could teleport out, but it's hardly worth the effort, is it? Plus, I couldn't teleport to where I was. I would have finished exploring the island. I thought there might be more here on this island to see. And it's really hard to explore stuff on the zeppelin. It's much better to do it on foot. If you're not on foot, it's real easy to miss stuff, I think. The Initiate's Ring. I've never seen that before. Or one of those before. Let's have a look at that. Here it is. Makes a critical hit slightly more likely. Really? Woo. So excited right now, but not really. I know this is lazy because it's like right there, but... I just want to come down here. I couldn't be fight walking the long way. To be honest with you, I'm just too lazy. Okay, there's nothing here except this, which is... Looney corn. Are there any loony peas or some shit? I don't even know. Have I been in here? Doesn't look like it. Blowtorch cave and a trapdoor again. Yeah, we're finding stuff to do at least. Nothing like amazing, but... It's still stuff. Dungeons. Maybe there's one of the uh, mirror things in here that we can traverse. I feel like we could probably cope with one. First time we do it at like level fucking 10 or something. I think some of them are a lot stronger than others. I don't recommend level 60, but I assume that's to get all the way through the whole lot. I'm raring to go. And we're pretty close to level 60 now anyway. Hey, a tropical fangfish. It's been a while since I've seen one of you. You're gonna die, you know. Here goes. You're making a mistake. We're far too strong for you. Here goes. Get wrecked. Yeah, the enemies here are high level at least, so that's something. Something to know. Something to make note of. Alright, let's go this way. A save point. Another fucking door. Scary, scary. I'm assuming there's more than just the nine then that uh, you're meant to do for the mission. I assume I can't open this one either. This one I can open. But the enemies here are too strong, I think. It would be a mistake. Well, then we're getting close to the right level, I think. I don't know. I don't know. Should we give it a go? No, oh, fuck it. We got nothing to lose. If we die, we just end up back here anyway. Let's give it a go. In we go. It's been so long since we've done one of these. I'm sure we'll be fine. And then we gotta do it fast. Air attacks have no effect. I've forgotten what we were even doing. It's been so long since we've been in one of these. We have to collect orbs. And we have no map. And there's a higgledy. Glacier crystal cluster. Thanks. That sounds cool. We get the orbs by killing stuff, right? Here goes. We just need to find the way down to the next level, right? And we can use the orbs, in theory, to make the enemies less powerful. Okay, I found a dead end. That's a worry. I feel like I'm stuck here already. This way. 
Scala Paladin. Yeah, we don't really have time just to gather stuff. We've got to keep moving. When the danger level gets really high, it gets super fucking scary in here. Super scary. But we are so close to the level, maybe we can actually go and do all the mirror doors. This will be over in no time. It's only the recommended level is only ten levels above us. We can tend to fight things and handle missions that are around ten levels above us, usually. Wand. For the most part, we can handle ten levels above us. Next floor. How many floors is it? Like ten or something, eh? It's a lot, I know that. It takes ages. This will be the rest of the episode will be doing this. Guaranteed. And I remember the pots had those in them. It's the only time pots ever have anything in them in this game. Is in those bits. Hey, so how you again? Eight orbs. Sick. Thanks, man. That was totally worth having. Alright, here we go. Watch this. Get fucked! It's over already. Let me have the fucking treasure. Another Wonder Wisdom. Slightly different one, but still a Wonder Wisdom nonetheless. We're going to have a danger level increase in a moment. So this will bring it back down to zero. There you go. Back to zero. Well, back to as low as it can possibly get because it didn't quite make one level up. That only cost like six orbs. That was worth doing. That was definitely worth doing. Oh my god, it's you. You're going to waste my time, asshole. Cap his ass. Fuck you, bruh! Get wrecked. Ooh, red prisms. That's good for making Higgledies, I believe. Fire Higgledies, specifically. Ah, fuck. It's a dead end. It's so hard to find your way in this place. Everything looks so similar all the time. Haven't I been both ways? Pretty sure I've been both ways. Hang on, we'll head back this way. That must be what we fucked up. Went the wrong way this way. We gotta hurry, danger level's skyrocketing again. This is what we came out of. Oh, okay. 25 orbs, I don't have 25 orbs, it must be something fucking amazing. With 25 fucking orbs, it better be something incredible. You better like lick my ass for me. Lick my ass clean every time I go to the toilet. I mean that's amazing, right? That would be amazing? Sure. <laughs> anyway. Usually this lady's standing next to the door, but I can't see the door. I'm wasting time. Like, I dropped it to zero and now it's going back up again. Because I can't find the fucking door. But it's a dead end, like, everywhere. I must have walked past it a dozen times. If I haven't found it yet, surely. I do not understand. Lady, help me out here. Is it the door I came in? Can I try that one again? Because if that's the case, I just wasted my time. I could have just used this one. Oh, it is that one. I started right next to it. I didn't even need to explore that floor. I could have just skipped it. Well, I wish I'd known that earlier. 
Now danger level's gonna go up. That's gonna make life less fun for us. Hey, hey, goody. Seven orbs, nice. Handing out these orbs like they're fucking... Discount coupons for pizza. They're real good, thanks. Danger level's about to go up and there's not much we can do about it. We are gonna grind up some levels like this, I think. This is one of the harder things we can do, I guess, in the game, apart from fighting tainted monsters. So it's gonna skyrocket our level. I know you're distracting me with orbs, but... There's so many, how can I not grab them? 40, what are the fucking things now? 35? Sure, whatever. It's a wand! Stop giving me fucking wands, I'm not using anyone with a wand. See, now, if I come across something that'll lower the danger level, I won't have the orbs to do it. Most likely. So, well played game, well played. You know I could not pass up a treasure chest. Well played. You got me there. Next floor. We will need to reduce the danger level soon though. If it gets above three, we are fucked. Well and truly fucked. I mean, we can just push through it a bit faster, I guess. Yeah, we can get our orbs back. Until I see another treasure chest, and then handle my orbs over again. Well, there's the door right there. It's ten. You know what? It's probably worth... Grinding out one more orb for that. Except there's no more orbs here. Well, that's a shame. Let's just kill this grim chiller fucking pranger then. Here goes nothing. There you go, now we got enough. So let's just quickly lower it before we leave, because I don't know when we'll get another chance. And I think it's randomly generated, so we may not even get another chance. Nice, back to zero basically. So we're out of orbs again. But that's okay, I think we got this. I think we're okay. Just keep moving. I don't know how many floors there are, that's what worries me. We can't open that, there's no point even checking it, because it's going to be more than fucking one orb, surely. Pretty much guaranteed it's going to be more than one orb to open it. Okay, we're on to the next floor already, that's good. I'm going to grab these. Here it goes. Okay, that was unnecessary. We're gonna move down to the next floor because we're not gonna build up the meter very fast if we can just skip floors. I do want to collect the treasure, but at the same time I want to stay alive. That's kind of important. And if we die now, we put all this time into this dungeon dive for nothing. For failure. And that sounds like a bad plan to me. Let me grab these items though on the way. I'm not gonna check that done either because we've only got five orbs. I'm going to quickly knock these pots open. There's a lady there that reduces the danger level, but frankly with it so low at the moment, there's no point. And it's not even moving. It's stopped at 18.9%. That's weird. Maybe it's because all the enemies are dead. Maybe once all the enemies on a floor are dead, they, it stops going up. That could be a thing. That'd be pretty cool. Maybe it goes, because it seems to go slower sometimes. Maybe it goes slower the less enemies that are alive on the floor. Or something. That would make sense, right? Okay, we got some enemies. Leave this to me. Here goes. You're fucked. Eat this. You did. Oh, there's the door as well. Well, that's handy. I think I have to kill Skeletal Paladins for a mission as well that I've got at the moment. You fucked! 
I don't waste my time with you fools, I just cap your asses. Just pa 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 pow Pop a cap in your ass. See, I should get down there. I'm not going to, but I should. Instead, I'm gonna grab that. And I'm gonna grab this, and I'm gonna grab that, and then I'm gonna leave. To the next floor. Because there's a lot of these to get through, realistically. A lot. Next floor. Should be dropping some really good items too, like weapons and armor here should be real good. Because the enemies are so strong. There's the lady again. We don't need her, but... We know she's here if we have to before we leave. Five orbs, nice. Bunch more orbs, always nice. Rugged spud. That's what I've always wanted. Every day I say to myself, maybe today will be the day that I get a rugged spud. Maybe. But it never happened, you know? And now, now I'm swimming in rugged spuds. Okay, the door's already here. So that was easy. Keep moving. We're out of time for the episode, but I am going to obviously plow through this in time. Dungeon before we're out of time. If I can, I'll try. Hello, Hello you. Self sweet. Why do they call me that, you ask? Because my sweet has magical healing properties. And you just need to slather some of it on yourself, and all your wounds will be healed. I don't even charge for it. Well, does that sound good or does that sound good? I thought you'd say that. Alright, come to Uncle Self Sweet. <laughs> there we go, all better. But you feel like a million guilders. Fucking free healing. Badass. I'm just gonna go straight back down. If we get to the boss before the uh, danger level goes up, we might be okay. I think once we get to the boss floor, the danger level stops going up too. There's a treasure chest. Oh, I was so enticed. You see how enticed I was? I was like turning around and stuff. I couldn't decide which way to go. Three orbs. We're gonna get our danger level increase in a second. Hopefully we come across the lady again, soon. So we're gonna load up on orbs here. We have 35, and we're gonna try to avoid the temptation of opening the treasure chest. Which is something that's very difficult for me. Sprite fire silk. There's a whole bunch of items they're giving me that I have never seen before. Like sprite fire silk. Open the chest, dumb shit! I don't know what that is either. Autumn Haze Button. That's new to me as well. Never seen that before. Right, danger level 2. Try to avoid that. Even though I really, really, really want to open it. The lady's over there, so that's good. We can mash these fools. Here goes. Goodbye. Here goes. Good. Here. We're gonna go over here, we're gonna hit the lady. Watch this. Eat this. We're gonna drop our danger level and then we're gonna leave. Because we can. Fuck is up there. At this stage, we've pretty much got free reign. As long as we're back before it hits danger level 3, it'll drop back to 0. So I say we do a little bit of exploring while we can. What is this thing? Just a crystal? We can't do anything with it? Good to know. Orb. Orb. Okay, there is actually nothing up here. Grumpy Lumber. Maybe this is where we get some of those items that I haven't been able to find. I'm guessing that's how it is. Alright, now we hit this lady and it should drop it back to zero. And then we can hit the door and be gone and we'll be back at zero, pretty much. It was at 15. That's ruthless, man. That's a lot. Although we're very far in and we're still only at danger level one, so I think we're doing alright. Hopefully we get to the boss soon. And we can take him on at his base level. The Floor of Respite. Oh, it's not going up. 
at all. Okay, so we get to relax here and take our time. Pick up items. Get some orbs. All of that sort of jazz. Very nice. And we can drop our danger level too if we wanted. Happy Daredevil armor. Nice. It's a different color to the stuff we've been picking up before. Maybe we should check our gear then while we're here as well. No reason to hurry while we're here. We can relax, chill out. Level 51, so we got one level since we've been here. Fuck, it's slow going, my man. It is slow going. A bolt eagle feather. Nice. Thank you. Alright, so we're going to check our gear nice and quick because we've been picking some stuff up. Not swords, apparently. Uh, that's not good. Okay, so, yeah. We've been picking stuff up. Nothing especially good, but we've definitely been picking stuff up. Okay, good to know. At least we, oh, there you go. A new fucking, a new lance. That's good. Alright, well, yeah, that's all. We got to put one new lance on here and that was it. Let's move on to the next floor. Oh, we ran out of time for the episode. Again. <laughs> ran out of time for two episodes in one episode. Boss, please! So if we escape, we get to keep our items. If we don't, we die, and then we lose all our items. Oh. There's always something behind me, and that's dodgy how it, like, starts you facing a specific direction. As if there's nothing behind you, but there actually always is stuff behind you. It's fucking annoying. Good luck, everyone. Beat this. Here goes! Get wrecked! And die. Thank you! And treasure! And pots! Six sensor again! Is there anything worse to be getting as a fucking prize than six sensor? I can't think of anything worse. It's like you've been giving a dog shit. Here, have a dog shit in the mail. Someone's sending you a dog shit in the mailbox. In your P.O. box. So the other thing smells of dog shit. Yes. I'm the most gifted fortune teller in all the world. There's nothing I can't not, that cannot be known through the application of my incredible powers. Will you employ my services and have me apply my second sight in all six senses to the task of dividing what your future holds? My fears poultry, 5,000 guilders. Sure. That's nothing to me. We begin by crossing, your palm, crossing my palm with silver. You mean 5,000 guilders. Om nom, I see it! The gift brings you vision of the world to come, of your future. The next floor will be subject to a special condition, that condition will be... I see you as you are now, and yet greatly improved somehow, yes. The next floor will be one which a great deal of personal development will take place, that much is certain. Are you serious? You just waste five grand, you fucking muppet? I mean, five grand is not a lot, but still... That was fucking useless to me. Might as, well, might as well have just said, hey, give me five grand, please. And I would have probably given it to you anyway. And then you didn't talk and just fucked off and took your five grand with you. We could have just done that. Why didn't we do that? Wasting my time, asshole. Tiny bulwark brooch. Nice. Next floor. How many floors have we been down now? We're like floor 15. Can we fucking fight the boss now and be gone? Challenge me against the boss. I'm sure I can handle it. Yeah, I'm not positive. Watch your but I guess we'll find out if we can handle it. Beat this. Fuck you! Oh my god. That was a ruthless battle, man. It involved mass killing. We tore them apart. With no remorse, no fucking fur, like no, we didn't hold back at all. There was no mercy. 
Not a drop of mercy was to be given. What do we get? Strong six sensor. Well, that's crap. Thanks for the crap, craphead. Oh. Okay, danger level's about to go up again. We're up to floor 15 now. Jesus Christ. Final floor. 50 orbs to reduce. I don't have 50 orbs, and I'm only at danger level 1 anyway. And this is the final boss floor, so. Not the final boss, the boss floor, so. Uh, we're good. We're good. I don't think I need your services. Thank you, lady. But I appreciate the help. Alright, you're the boss, are you? Really? One of these pig dudes is the boss? Well, that's kind of limp. Hey! Dickhead! Fuck you! Orchestrator. It's only level 55. Should be able to cope with this fine. Get fucked! Yeah, he doesn't actually do that much damage either. He's actually quite unintimidating. Although he does knock you over when he hits you, which is fucking annoying. He's frustrating to fight already. Not strong, but fucking an annoying. I mean, he's not weak. But compared to some of the stuff we fought recently, he's not that intimidating. In fact, my gunshots do quite significant damage to him. You're dead, son. Oh, you nearly got me. That would have killed me too, I would imagine. Chase me around, you fucking weirdo. See you later. Finish him. Boom! Cannon shot. Nice. Moving on. Smoky Quartz Hue Bloom, and a dollop of Sweet Sap, and a White Dream Fragment. Do we get to carry our uh, orbs over? Because there's a lot of orbs hanging around. I really hope you get to carry them over to the next floor because I got so many! Like 42! That's lots! When do I get to use them if I don't get to carry them over? Do I have to go back and find one of the treasure chests? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe that's what we're going to do for the next little while. Do some more of these dream mazes. I think we can handle them. Honestly, and our level's going up. By the time we get to the last one, we will be level 60. I imagine. So I think we can probably handle it. I was going to go fight the, uh... Done. I was going to go fight the, uh... The tainted monsters, but I don't know how to find them, to be honest. Right, from just walking around randomly. All right, we're gonna save in this episode here and in the next one Maybe we'll try and find the next dreamer maze. Till then, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out with me and I'll see you in the next one